hello everyone and welcome back i'm here to do a fall slash a bunch of stuff a haul for you guys today since i haven't done one of these in a while and you guys really seem to like it last time so i thought i'd give it another go sorry if you hear my dog making noise over here in the corner but yes i did some shopping recently at forever 21 mod cloth and h&m so some really budget friendly things that i can't wait to show you guys uh, mix a little bit of higher end uh, with the mod cloth with some more budget friendly pieces that I can't wait to show you. So we will get started first with the Forever 21 items which I have already taken out of the bag but I think you guys will get the idea. And first thing is this really cute hip bag and I've been seeing these everywhere and I knew that I had to have one but I didn't want to pay like an exuberant amount for one. So I found this one and it was only $17.90, uh, $17 so we could say $18, a little bit over $18, bucks, which is a great deal. And as you can see, it has the tassel, super cute, roomy, it's got two compartments, and this definitely is kind of a similar look to a lot of the high-end designer pieces that I see. So this is one that I can definitely see me wearing out with my friends, or going to a theme park, or just going exploring somewhere. And I've been seeing a lot of people wear it as like the crossbody. So I might try to, to see how that, that trend goes and maybe I'll try it out as well. Next up is this sweater, which I saw and you guys know I love color. And I immediately fell in love with it. It is all the colors of the rainbow, so many colors. And it's this really soft, almost soft corduroy type of uh, material. And just look at all these fun fall colors. I've actually already worn this for an Instagram um, picture earlier because it's getting a little bit cooler here in Alabama. Thank, thank the Lord it is. And I'm so glad that it is because I'm ready to burst out all these fun outfits. But yeah, this sweater was actually 20 bucks. So, you know, a really good, not even an investment piece because it's $20, but still, um, this is something that you can wear all fall and something that's also more on the trendy side so you're not spending a ton of money because I know how these trendy pieces are uh, that you might not love it next season, but this is definitely in this color blocking and all of these fun colors in for this season. So $20 for that. And that brings me to another sweater, which is this fun striped. I loved this pink color right here. As you can see, the ribbed lining, super cute. A mix of pink, black, and yellow. A little bit of brown flowing in there uh, for some neutral neutrality. And this was $17.90. So again, this is something that you might see similar at a store like Madewell, which is definitely a little bit more expensive. And this one is definitely more budget friendly that can work in your budget, especially if you live somewhere like I do in the South where it's not hot all the time. So maybe you don't want to spend a ton of money on a lot of false and winter pieces because we don't necessarily get one except for a few days a year so uh yeah definitely a good a good piece to have um pair it with a corduroy skirt or you can pair it with tan suede whatever denim and it works so it's just a good piece uh the next it was just this i actually got on sale for a little halloween um costume i'm going to be shooting soon i'm not going to tell you what it is but it's just this you might be able to figure it out. It's from an iconic TV character. I'll leave it at that. That I'm going to pair with a tutu. So you probably already guessed it by now. But still. Um, yeah, it's just a simple bodysuit that I can wear. And this was marked down to um, $6.90. So $6.90 for a bodysuit that I can also wear after um, the shoot as well. You can pair it with a denim jacket, leather jacket, whatever. It's something that's easy that can go with a lot of things that you don't want that bulky material, especially if you wanna wear a jacket with it. Like I said, in the South, it gets hot still in the fall and winter. So these are good pieces to have on hand. Next up are two really cute skirts. And the first one is this rust colored skirt, which I saw in the store and I was obsessed with, as you can see. Um, one thing that you do have to watch out for with Forever 21 is the sizing. Um, since it is a little cheaper material, obviously the sizing is going to be a little bit smaller. I got this in a large and it actually fits pretty well. And I can see myself wearing this um, throughout the fall season and winter, pairing it with leggings and booties. And it just looks super cute and I love, love the, um, the waistband. It's got a zipper in the back as you can see. 
and this was $15.90. So again, another good piece that you can add to your wardrobe that isn't super expensive. And as you can tell, just look at the quality. It's pretty good quality and um, it looks higher in than what it is. And last up from Forever 21, I saw this skirt and I had to have it. And it is this kind of color blocked, I guess you could say, autumn inspired. We have the deep purple, we have black, we have beige, we have everything going on. And this is built a little bit, this is from their collection that is a little bit higher in. This was 20, 24 dollars so 25 bucks, a little bit pricier, but still within a good realm of, um, this was from, yeah, from their little bit higher end brand that is a little more expensive than I would normally pay for some of their things. But like I said, this is a good piece that I can see myself wearing all throughout the season and even in years to come. So that's it for the Forever 21 section. We will move on to H&M next. So I have not been into H&M in forever. So I made a little trip over to my local mall today to see what all they had. And they did not disappoint. They had so many cute things. And I know I keep saying cute a lot and that's annoying. So I'm gonna try to say different words. They had a lot of fun pieces in today and a lot of fun fall picks. So here's what I scooped up. And I don't wear a ton of orange, even though I went to a college that, that orange is one of their main colors. So War Eagle, if you're an Auburn fan. And I don't own a ton of it though, but I loved this, um, this sweater, which I think is so quintessential fall. It's got so much um, brightness in it. I love this orange color. I think it's perfect for late October since it is starting to get cooler here. And this can easily be worn into November and December as well. So a good staple, um, staple for fall. And this was $25. So a great price for a sweater that has this type of material that is pretty well made. So I was impressed with that. I thought it was gonna be more expensive, but was pleasantly surprised with the price. Okay. Next up, okay, so there are gonna be some Halloween things in this haul as well, as well as the mock cloth haul, which I'm excited to show you guys. But this was a skeleton sweatshirt. And as you can see, it's got the little bones on the arms. This is similar to one that you might could find at Wild Fox Couture, which is another brand that I love, but it is very expensive. So this is something that if you're not wanting to spend a ton of money on kind of seasonal pieces, this is the way to go. But I thought this would look really cute with a leather skirt, a denim skirt. Uh, you know, different varieties to skirts to pair with this, especially if you're going maybe to a haunted house or you're going to see a scary movie, going to do something fun on Halloween night and you don't want to wear a rock a full costume. But this is a fun way. Work even, you know, if you want to show the spirit but you don't want to be completely horrifying, then this is the way to go. And this was only $9.99. So this is a good price, as especially compared to Wild Fox, which is something similar to this sweatshirt that I have. It's probably over $100. So definitely saves you money uh, for a seasonal piece. Next up, oh, I love this sweater when I saw it. Again, I don't like to buy a ton of sweaters and a ton of really cold items just because like I previously said, it doesn't get super cold here in Alabama, but I loved the colors in this one. So we have light gray, pale pink, really pretty burgundy, light blue, and then this really pretty kind of tan, a uh, little bit darker tan up here at the top. So this is a cute sweater. It's baggy. Uh, I got a medium in this, which when H&M I kind of fluctuate between a medium and a large. And if I wanted the sweater, I just wanted it a little bit bigger, I decided to go with a large. So you can see all the fun colors here. And I think this will be a really fun sweater to wear as it gets cooler. The next is also a sweatshirt. I racked up on the sweatshirts and the sweaters today. Is this fun horse embellished, I guess you would say, <laughs> sweatshirt. And I just saw one, it just kind of stood out to me. I got back from Texas recently, so I kind of have a little cowboy thing going on here. And it's really soft, really comfortable. You can see the stitching and everything. Pretty good branding. And this was. $29.99 and again this is a little bit more expensive than what I would typically play for somewhere like H&M or Forever 21 but it is a really good quality as you can see and I like these sweatshirts that don't have the really fuzzy material underneath just because I find them to be kind of hot 
and like I was you know talking about that when it is if you're living in a climate that's not super cold all the time these sweatshirts are kind of the way to go so I can't wait to pair this with a black skirt and some booties and rock it yeah next up is speaking of black skirts I saw this one and I loved it I've been wearing a skirt like this for a while and I've seen some more expensive ones and I wasn't sure how much I really wanted to invest into it as you can see it's got a zipper that goes up and down so yeah a zipper all the way up and down and I just really like I think black you can wear with anything it's a classic and it's kind of got this suede type material so perfect for fall and winter and again this is something that I can see me wearing throughout the fall and winter months and it was $29.99 and I got this in, it's a size 10. It looks like it runs pretty true to size, maybe a little bit smaller than normal. So again, keep whenever you're shopping at Forever 21 and H&M, which both of those offer a variety of sizes that if you're kind of feeling uncertain, I would definitely size up because in my opinion, it's rare to have something that's a little too big that maybe you can take in as opposed to something that's too small because that can sometimes be a pain to deal with. And last up is, I just saw this as I was walking out. It's this fun little, leopard print i guess and dress cheetah print whatever and i love the material it's really soft and satiny and it's something that i can see myself pairing with a leather jacket or maybe um a black cardigan but most definitely probably a uh, black or i have a um red leather jacket that i would love to pair for this just for like maybe a girl's night out or um going on a date night whatever just something that's fun or a concert i just like it and it's still you know it's got the buttons up the front and i like it where it's short, but it's not too short. So it's something that you can easily pair with booties and or boots or whatever and still look really stylish. And this was only $24.99, so $25 for a really fun dress that you can also transition easily into um, spring, especially if you wanna put maybe a black turtleneck underneath it. Sorry, my dog's walking around on the side. That's what you can hear. But if you just wanna pair a black all sleeve like um, bodysuit or turtleneck underneath it, and then of course when it's spring and summer, you can wear it sleeveless. So a good, a good piece for $25 that I can see myself wearing a lot. Well, I hope that you enjoyed this part of the H&M haul. I want to say we're done, but no, we're not done. We still have H, we still have, not H&M, we just did H&M. We have mod cloth to get to. And it's a fun one because it's all Halloween items. So let me go get the packaging and I'll be right back. Okay, and I am back with the mod cloth. As you can see our fall inspired paper and yes, I've already taken it out because I'm not one of those people that can open it very gracefully on camera. So I've already got everything out ready to show you guys. And yes, these are seasonal items. So really, really uh, cute and very spooky, I guess, if you will. And um, Mod Cloth is one of my favorite um, brands to buy from just because I love that they have a variety of sizes. They have everything from like extra, extra small, two, three, four X. So anything that you want, they kind of have and they have the best dresses and really fun. Like I was talking about seasonal items for Christmas, Valentine's Day, and of course Halloween. So the first item, which was one that was out of stock for a while, but they got it back. It's a sweatshirt that's the Great Pumpkin. As you can see, Linus sweating here for the pumpkin. And this is something that I can see myself wearing. We're going to a pumpkin patch soon, so I think that'll be fun. And just kind of slipping it on, maybe if you're going to a late movie or going for a run or you just have to go run errands. And I think it's just a cute little way to celebrate the season. And it's so soft. It does Now, this one does have a little bit more of the fuzzy material here. But it's not too hot. It seems it seems lighter weight than the the really strict the really strict fleece, if you know what I'm talking about. But yeah, I love the color, the blue, and the print. It's just really cute and so seasonal. Oh, I love it. It's cute. Uh, the next is this top, which I saw and thought was adorable because it looks like a simple little black and white collar. But check out the side, a little black cat, which is perfect for Halloween. And this again is something that you can wear any time of the year, but extra fun and spooky around Halloween. And I thought I would probably pair it, even though it's black, and I know sometimes people don't like mentioning black and navy together. I saw this skirt with the candy corns on it, and I thought, how much more Halloween can you get? And I'm probably gonna pair those two things together. And this of course would look cute with um, a bodysuit. I like to wear the black off the shoulder bodysuits a lot. Especially if you follow me on Instagram, you can see that I rock that trend a lot. But I love this. I think that it's so seasonal. 
and just a really festive way to get prepared for the spookiest of holidays. And last but not least is another skirt. I'm probably gonna take this one to my trip to Orlando and then out to LA in two weeks for some haunted happenings that we're doing. And I loved the print. Look at the black hats and the pumpkin. It's just a really classic Halloween print. And this is again something I would wear with a simple off the shoulder bodysuit, black tank top, black quarter length shirt, anything that you can kind of um, have the black and orange since that is such a classic Halloween combination. And of course I saw this and uh, definitely knew that I had to have it and uh, keep it in my wardrobe. And one thing I will say about mall cloth is they are very well, well made. I don't like to buy a ton of seasonal items because you really only have about a month or two that you can wear them. And I will say that I have items that I have from their Christmas collection and Halloween collection um, that I got, you know, last year and the year before, but there are things that I can keep in my wardrobe and that I can just use them the next year as well because they are made of good material and they last. So that's something that's really important if you are going to be buying um, clothes that are a little bit more expensive. You want to make sure that you're not just wearing it and then it tears or you're just wearing it once or twice and then throwing it out. So definitely investment pieces that you can keep and uh, from Maka. So I really hope that you guys enjoyed that haul. Uh, there's a lot of fun fall clothing as always i will link everything at the bottom for you guys if you have any questions please let me know if you like the video please like subscribe comment tell me what you liked about it and if you have any other questions please let me know and thank you so much for watching bye